All right, what's up clowns? Welcome to another Pokemon Sun and Moon Wi-Fi battle. This time, we are having a battle against Gandhi. He's a guy from my Discord, so if uh, anybody would like to battle me, hit up my Discord or my Twitter. Links, as always, are in the description below, and uh, we'll try to schedule a battle. So, this guy's been asking for a battle for a long time. I feel so bad, but uh, I've just been really busy lately. <laughs> but um, we'll go ahead and see... What this man is going to bring, we actually started the battle, but I apparently disconnected, so hopefully we don't have uh, that issue anymore. <laughs> but um, once he gets into his team, let's see here. <sighs> Setting up a battle takes fucking forever <laughs> in these games. But uh, yeah, hopefully I don't DC again. Um, if we do, I don't know, maybe we'll have to try this again tomorrow or something, who knows. But obviously if this video goes up, then... <laughs> you'll know that we didn't DC, so. All right, we're just waiting on him to accept. Looks like he did. And the team preview should pop up in a moment. So his team is really, really scary. Um, so he's got the Zerkatry, Mimikyu, the possible Mega Metagross. I don't know, he didn't show it. The only Mons he's shown um, were the Zerkatry and the Latios. Um, so he's got Mimikyu. Already said Metagross, he's got Terrakion, Arcanine, and the Latios. Last time he led off Zerkatry, I don't know if he's going to do the same. Um, I led off Bronzong, and I think that's probably what I still want to do. Um, so we'll go ahead and do that. And we'll go ahead and lock that in. So, <laughs> once again, good luck, have fun, may the best man win. And uh, I was talking about how I changed my character... Uh, clothes finally <laughs> I was like wearing the same outfit forever <laughs> but um I went ahead and changed up the outfit a little bit so I kind of dig it so he is gonna lead Zerkatry once again that is totally fine last time he volt switched right out um, so I'm imagining that's what he's going to do and last time let me see did he want to Okay, he wants to do the same thing over. So instead of going for the Gyro Ball, because I know he's going to probably swap <laughs> into the Laddie, um, I'm just going to set up Stealth Rocks so we can have the uh, <laughs> the same uh, play as before, basically. And he actually does a little bit more damage um, than last time, which is <laughs> definitely unfortunate. So I'm assuming Laddie is coming out here. Yep. Um, so we're going to get up our rocks, which he could have defog on Laddie. It's, I think it's more common on Latios rather than Latios, but I have seen it on Os as well. Um, so here, this is actually where we DC'd last time. So I'm actually going to bring in the Chansey and we'll see what this man wants to do. If he drops a Draco, Psy Shocks, he goes for Shadow Ball, obviously doesn't affect us. All right, we are in business, so we did not DC, thankfully. <laughs> um, I'm just going to go for the Seismic Toss here, as I'm assuming he's probably going to swap. Perhaps, maybe, maybe not. Maybe he's got Psy Shock. Nope, he is going to swap. So something's going to take some Rocks damage. He's going to bring in the Terrakion. That's totally fine. We're going to get some nice chip damage off. And uh, I think we'll bring in... Uh, I think we'll bring in good old Quagsire. Wow, Seismic Toss does more than I thought. Um, interesting. Let me make sure I'm recording. I am, okay. Um, actually... You know what? Amoongus wouldn't be bad here at all. I'm gonna bring in Amoongus. And, uh, I am rocking a stall team, as I'm sure you guys are all well aware. I know a lot of people don't like stall, but it is actually one of my more preferred ways to play. He's gonna go for the Stone Edge. It does a shit ton to me. Holy crap. That does way too much damage. But uh, let me peep his team real quick. He doesn't have anything that can't go to sleep. So I'm going to go straight for the Spore. And we'll see what this man wants to do. If he stays in, Terrakion's going Betty by. <laughs> if not, something's going to sleep. He's going to stay in, and he misses his Stone Edge. I'm so sorry about that, dude, but it is Pokemon. <laughs> Believe me, I have missed many, many attacks in my day. So, Terrakion is going to Betty by. And I think here is good enough time.
time as any to actually would he swap let me see I could see Arcanine coming in you know I kind of want to go for the foul play here on the predicted switch he's gonna bring in the Latios so I know Latios doesn't have the greatest physical attack in the world but it's still super effective so maybe it'll do a decent amount let's see it does yeah it does okay damage not <laughs> I mean obviously not anything to write home about plus he probably has roost <laughs> but um definitely some solid damage there I will take it and uh, we'll swap out here we'll get our regenerator and uh, bring out Chansey over easy as he's going to go for the Psy Shock still eh, it's probably gonna hurt a little bit yeah <laughs> unfortunately it hits on the defensive side rather than the special side so I'm gonna go for a wish here as he's going to swap out he's going to bring out the Mimikyu now Mimikyu is always always a problem so at least we're gonna get some stealth rocks so I gotta play around this thing. This thing is a massive, massive threat. <sighs> hmm. And I literally cannot touch this thing with Chansey, so I'm gonna have to swap here. And I think my play is probably Quagsire. We'll see what this man wants to do. If he sets up, that's great. He's going to sub, actually. So damn, now I have to break. I have to go through his sub and his fucking disguise. So that is not good. And he's leftovers rather than life orb. Interesting. Don't think I've ever seen this before. I'm going to go for Scald. As he goes for the play rough here. Let's see how much this does. Yeah, Quagsire is a tank. Eats that for breakfast. And uh, if we could get a burn on this Mimikyu, <laughs> that would be excellent. I mean, obviously, we can't burn it through the sub, but we can, in fact, burn it through the the disguise, which is pretty red. All right, let's see. What are you going to do? Are you going to risk Mimikyu getting burned, or are you going to swap? Um, yeah, I think all around, pretty much, Scald is a fairly safe move. Because, I mean, if he swaps, he's going to take Stealth Rocks plus Scald and then the possibility of a burn. So. And if he swaps out Mimikyu, he's going to take more Rocks damage. So, either way, I don't really mind. We'll see what this man wants to do. <laughs> Alright, so he is going to swap and he's going to bring out the Laddie. So, if we could get burn chip damage off, that would be excellent. I would not be mad. Not at all. We do not get the burn. Unfortunate, but it is okay. Um, if he has Roost, he's definitely going for it now. Um, unfortunately, I don't have Ice Beam. Otherwise, I would gladly go for it here. I'm going to bring out Chansey here. I'm probably going to, instead of going for Wish, I'm going to go for the Soft Boiled. I actually carry both on this Chansey. It is mainly a Cleric Chansey, after all. He's going to drop a Draco. Let's see how much this does. Um, yeah, okay, it does, it, <laughs> holy shit, Chansey is so fucking bulky, it's disgusting. I'm gonna go for a soft boiled here, it actually didn't even bring me below half, that is wild. That is absolutely wild, this Chansey is so bulky. He's gonna bring out the Arcanine now. Possibly a more offensive variant, I know Arcanine do get access to close combat, so I do have to kind of watch out for that. Um, what do you go for that? So we are back to full health. Um, this is excellent. He took a massive amount of rocks damage there. I will gladly take that, but I think the play is back into Quagsire. And if I can get rid of Arcanine, I can bring out Skarm and start setting up spikes freely. Arcanine's the only thing that's stopping me bringing out Skarm. He's going to go for the extreme speed. That doesn't really tell me anything. Hmm. But I think here I'm just going to go for... 
I'm gonna go for a Scald. And like, like before, if he swaps out, Arcanine's gonna take another 25% from rocks. I don't think he has a way to get rid of hazards, which is excellent for me. He is doing so much, so much switching. He's gonna bring out the Zerka Tree, take some rocks, and a Scald. If we could get a burn, that'd be excellent. No burn, of course. <laughs> Just my luck. All right, next we are going. I think we'll just bring out Liberty here again. Okay, we'll see what this man wants to do. Possibly Volt Switch, Grass Knot. All right, so we got to make sure that we remember Zerker. Yeah, Zerker Tree does have the Grass Knot. Um, so here. Um, I think here I'm going to go for the Gyro Ball. And we'll see if he brings out the Arcanine. He brings out Terrakion. So I think Terrakion's going to go down here if I'm not mistaken. Uh, let's see here. It is super effective, I believe. Yeah, okay. So Terrakion goes down. That means I can spore something else on his team, which is great. And Terrakion being out of the way is awesome because Terrakion has a monstrous attack stat. So I'm quite, quite happy to have that gone. You know, Loki, if he does... Okay, he's going to bring out Mimikyu instead. I was going to say, if he brings out... Actually, why would you bring out Mimikyu? That's weird. But I'm going to go for Gyro Ball. Um, I was going to say, if he brings out Arcanine, I'm actually heatproof <laughs> on this on this uh, Bronzong. I don't have Levitate, <laughs> so I could probably... Well, maybe not at this range. He's going to go for the SD, that is fine. We're going to break his Disguise. Which is totally alright with me. Okay. So I think here I'm going to actually let him, I'm going to let him take down Bronzong as much as I don't want to. And uh, if he over, he goes for play rough. I can live this, maybe. Yeah, we live on three with a critical hit. So that's going to proc my berry and that's going to give me back half my health. <laughs> so holy shit. Wow, so Bronzong is going to claim two lives here. Holy shit. Bronzong is fighting for the MVP slot. <laughs> Holy shit. Dude, I fucking love this set. He's gonna bring out the Arcanine now. He's gonna take another 25%. Dude, Stealth Rocks are coming in so clutch here. <laughs> they really are. Um, do I wanna let you die? I almost feel like it's a shame if I just let Bronzong die, but I'm going to go for Psy Wave. Oh, he's going to go for a Z move, so I think it's probably better in the long run that I let Bronzong go down here. I'm, I'm assuming Inferno Overdrive. What's this going to be? Yep, <laughs> I knew it. So this is definitely going to kill me. So that'll get his Z move out of the way, so don't have to worry about that too much throughout this battle. So Bronzong is going to do or Bronzong is going to do well, but he did really really well in this game. Um I am not mad at all. <laughs> Bronzong did so well. Um I think here we can just sorry if <laughs> my stomach is like growling, dude. I I wonder if my mic picked that up. Sorry if you guys heard that. <laughs> but um I wonder if he'll switch here. Let me peep his team one more time. So Laddie's still alive. He's got the Metagross in the back. Um, I think I'm going to go for the EQ here in case he wants to bring out the Zerka Tree. He's going to bring out Latios. But that's fine. I mean, he's still not coming in for free. Dude, the rocks are coming in clutch. I kind of wish I went for Scald there. <laughs> oh well. It happens. 
I can just bring in Chansey here. We saw before how little a fucking Draco does. So, we're we're pretty solid just bringing out Chansey here. And uh who knows, maybe he'll <laughs> maybe he'll pull a double or something predicting the Chansey. But now that Terrakion's gone, he I don't think he really has much at all to hit Chansey. <laughs> And his Arcanine is really hurting. So if he has close combat, he really needs to bring it. Um, I'm going to go for the Seismic Toss. As he's going to spam Draco. This is going to do like nothing unless he crits me. <laughs> oh my god, that damage is adorable. <laughs> so this Seismic Toss I think is going to kill him actually. So we don't have to worry about the Laddie either. Okay, and if he brings in Arcanine, uh, that's probably going to tell me he has the close combat. But we can just swap out. He's going to bring in the Metagross now. Oh boy. <laughs> so this thing is actually a fucking problem. Um, I am going to get the absolute hell out of here. <sighs> I think I'm going to bring in Skarm. We have the Rocky Helmet on Skarm, and uh, I'm hoping he doesn't have the Ice Punch. I know a lot of Metagross do carry Ice Punch, <laughs> so hopefully this is one without it. <laughs> and uh, Metagross is actually getting Suspect tested right now, so it's probably going to go sometime soon here. Wow, that was a crit, guys. That just goes to show how fucking bulky Skarm is. I'm going to set up a layer of spikes here. <laughs> We're just going to hazard stack him to death, and he's going to swap out. He's going to bring out the Zerk. So we've got rocks and one layer of spikes now. <laughs> and with his switching, he is doing so much switching, holy shit. Um, so here we can just... <sighs> Unfortunately, Bronzong's gone, and Chansey's kind of hurt. I'm really hoping Chansey doesn't take much from Zerk. Hmm. I feel like he's just gonna Volt Switch. Yeah, I feel like he's just gonna Volt Switch. That's what I would do, probably. Maintain some momentum here. Uh, we'll see what this man wants to do. Hopefully we're not DCing. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it scared me a little bit there. Chansey's kinda hurt. He's going to go for Grass Knot again. Why? I guess maybe he thought I would predict an electric attack and go into Quag. I don't know what that was, but I'm a soft boiled here because Chance he's not looking too hot. And uh, at least this way we might get, we might be able to gauge how much. Oh, he's just going to swap. He's going to bring out the meta. The meta gross. So he's going to take some rocks and spikes. He's doing so much switching, dude. That's his downfall, I'm telling you. And I just have to switch into Skarm. Now, he could have something crazy. Like, does Metagross get access to, like, uh, Sword Stand? I don't think it does. I don't know. He could have some setup move. He's just going to go for Meteor Mash. Skarm is going to eat this, like, it's fucking nothing. God, Skarm is so bulky. Look at this. All the damage that we've done to this Metagross is just passive damage. <laughs> um, so what I kind of want to do here is predict the switch and go for Whirlwind. I think that's what we're going to do here. No, he goes for Zen Headbutt. Oh my god, Skarm is fucking amazing. So we're going to Whirlwind him out. Dude, this team is fucking devastating. This team is wild. Alright, so Arcanine comes out. He's going to take massive amounts of damage. Holy shit. And... We'll just bring out Quag here. And actually, Earthquake hits the remaining of his team super effectively. 
He does have the close combat, so he was predicting Chansey. That close combat did a lot. Damn. But yeah, the remain the remainder of his team is actually weak to the earthquake here, so he literally can't switch. <laughs> well, at least safely. So he's just gonna close combat. And Arcanine's going down here. And then I'm assuming he'll bring in the Zerk, and I'll, then I'll go into Chansey. <laughs> But yeah, dude, this team is pretty fucking rad. Now, obviously, Taunt is this team's nightmare. <laughs> so if I if I come across any Taunt users, this team is pretty well fucked. Or um, Encore, stuff like that. That really kind of shits on this team's hopes and dreams. <laughs> so Zerkatree comes in. He's almost dead. Chansey just comes in here and uh, does work. He's gonna T-bolt. Let's see how much that does. I was actually curious. Oh my god, that is <laughs> that is delicious. Okay, so here I'm just gonna seismic toss. <laughs> Dude, Chansey is too bulky. I hate Chansey when it's used against me. I understand why people hate this thing so much. <laughs> oh my god, dude. This was just utter destruction. <laughs> and his last mon is obviously Metagross. <laughs> is he gonna die to- no, he's not gonna die to hazards. And all we have to do is bring out Good old Skarm. Good old Robo Chicken. And that, I believe, boys and girls, is GG. So he's gonna Zen Headbutt. It's not gonna do too much. And then the Rocky Helmet will kill him, and that is game. Yep, good game, my friend. We will definitely battle again. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this battle. This was an ass kicking, if I <laughs> if I do say so myself. Um, holy shit, dude, I 5 0 this guy, holy fuck. Oh, I love this team, though. And, uh, of course, the team info will be in the description below. <laughs> but, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, normally, I don't post vids like this where I just completely destroy somebody, but, I don't know, it was fun. So, plus, I've posted videos where I get completely destroyed, too, so, it's whatever. So, I'm gonna get out of here, guys. I love you. Peace out.